I'm Dana Hogerson. When disaster strikes your home or business, tell your insurance provider you prefer the restoration company the Mountaineers call. Panhandle Cleaning and Restoration. 100% was a WU fan. My first game was in 07. I come to watch Pat White, Steve Slate, and Owen Smith. They blew Mississippi State out by a ton. I looked at my grandfather during the game and I was like, one day I'm gonna be a Mountaineer. And he just looked at me and said, all right, we'll see. It's just a dr dream come true for me to be able to come here, play here, you know, make plays and score my first touchdown here. I mean, it means a lot to me. Ball's on the right hash. Here's Greer dropping, Greer looking, Greer throwing wide open. We were out caught by Trayvon Wesco. Into the end zone on touchdown. The right sideline goes Wesco. The second career touchdown for Trayvon Wesco. I wanted to get one at home so bad. You know, I was running out of time almost. I didn't know if I could get one at home and then, you know, I get wide open. The corner bites on the play. He bites on the little swing pass to the running back. We had passed it to Tevin before. You know, I ran one and uh, it wasn't open. And then he bit on the swing, so he throws it. And I turn around and I can't, I turn around, all I see is the sun. I'm like, oh no, can't, I can't let this one go. I see the sun and then the, at the last second, I see like a little black dot and it just falls in my hand. And I walk in, I'm just like, thank God I got one here, <laughs> thank God. Starts up, gets by a defender, 40-45, takes on a defender, helmet to helmet, paint goes flying high into the air, and Trayvon Wesco with a 15-yard catch and run. There was almost like an explosion when Wesco put his helmet or shoulder down on the defender, and it was just like this explosion of white paint. Our coach preaches to us in the meetings, Coach Gerberi preaches to us every meeting, do not go down for nobody, do not go down. And I just don't try to go down, really. Every time I get, I really try to score. Because you never know when you're going to get it again. I'm playing with the best receivers in the country, man. They're taking 80, 60, 50. So, you know, I just try to make the most out of every opportunity. Why we're so successful, you know, offensively right now, he's a big part of that. So, you know, I, I've seen this coming for quite a while. It's meant everything. Like I tell everybody, I turned a dream into reality. And I'm sitting here now talking to you about how I'm here and then it's just it's just pretty crazy when you look back on it all when I was like seven years old or however old I was and I told my grandfather I'm gonna come here and play and you know now I'm sitting in the seat talking about me scoring it for my first touchdown it's just it's just wild and it's a blessing and it's a dream come true